All right, I want to get that holster done today too. So I'm going to start working on that a little bit. And then as the day progresses and it warms up a little bit, if it warms up a little bit, sun is shining, but it's cold. Uh, I will see if I can get time to get that out and hooked up to the generator battery. So that's where I'm at so far today, guys. All right, so anyway, I gave myself a little bit of wine to go by for now. So uh, let's see what I can come up with just to get some of it done. Takes care of some of that. Now, we'll go over here to the belt sander. Sure, let me take a walk to the other side of town. And uh, try to do a little cleaning up and make the edges a little better. Uh, the old belt sander, as soon as I'm done dropping things all over the place here. come over here sure drop shit why don't I let me get this off of here as you can tell everything is all over the place for now and uh, turn on the old puppy the kind of big just in case I want to put belt loops on it and not a belt snap of or a belt catch or a belt loop I left it big 
I left it big so that if I wanted to uh, cut belt loops in it, I can just cut the belt loops in it and then naturally I'll have to put a few more little screws around it. But uh, that real quick kind of gives me a start. It gives me a heading as to what I want to do. So, yeah. so, so it kind of gives me. I can get on to it. Uh, I may take a little bit more of this out, but other than that, all right, it fits in there pretty decent, uh, and it works. So, and it's not going to fall out. So, so that's kind of where I'm at so far. Now that was just doing it rough, like I say, until I decide. I'm still going to have to take a little of this off over here. Whoops, I'm sorry. A little of this off over here. Um, you know. Uh, and then uh, I may flatten this out a little bit. I don't know. Again, it all depends if I'm going to put slices in it. Hey, baby. But there we go. Okay, I'm back over here. Because I just want to trim this off a little bit more. Right about here. go back over to the belt sander to normally I wouldn't be running back and forth like this going nuts but the more I think about it the belt sander may be a good idea to keep a little bit closer Back over here, clean off some of these edges with the buffer. What it does is it kind of keeps it up a little bit. It gives you a nice smooth edge, if you see what I mean. So, yeah, it looks much better. Whoop. See that little bit of kinky right there? See it right there? I don't like that look right there. Oh, wait a minute. Right there. See it? back over here like I said this is something I just put together real quick because I had a bunch of those motors I still have two or three of them uh, so I bought the old uh, what you call it here trolley or whatever you want to call it hooked up a switch to it just put it between a couple of two by fours and ta -da! I use it for buffing my shoes buffing my leather holsters buffing my belts uh, buffing knees <laughs> so all right so that's where we're at now it didn't take all that long to get it started so that's a good start so that'll give me an indication where I want to go from here so like I say right now it fits in let me twist this so I can see what I'm looking at there so it fits in I'm all set and if it's on the belt, naturally it's going to come out a lot easier. But I don't want it so easy that it falls out. But that's kind of where we're at. Now I will put one more screw here. Up here next to the top. And I'll probably put another one down here. Or actually I could probably fit two. As long as they're spaced properly. I'll probably put a slice here for a belt. So this here way, it'll fit kind of like this. So I'll have to put the other slice right here here and here um, but that's where we're at so that's uh, that's the game plan so I'm just gonna kind of leave it be for now <laughs> 